Uh, let's talk about this weekend. It's going to be an interesting weekend out there. Today alone is going to be quite interesting, as if yesterday wasn't enough. But we are starting off with that sunshine out there. It's still coming up over the horizon, but don't expect it to be a sunny day. We are going to see clouds increase as we head towards the latter part of this morning, and then a pair of snow squalls coming through between noon to about 4 o'clock. So rapidly changing weather today. Tomorrow will be brighter, but still on the cold side. For now, as we take a look at our satellite and radar composite, everything is nice and quiet. All of the clouds and the snow still out towards upstate New York. And here's a live look in the Brass City, where it is much colder than it was at this time yesterday. About 16 degrees in Waterbury. It's 12 in Torrington, 19 in Hartford. We're starting at about 19 degrees here in New Haven. Now, luckily, we don't have the wind that we had at this time yesterday. Winds are pretty calm across most of the state, but a wind advisory is going to be in effect for most of Connecticut today as with those snow squalls coming through, winds could start gusting upwards of 40 miles per hour. Even though Hartford, Tolland, and Wyndham County are not under that wind advisory, those spots, yes, you could even see gusts upwards of 35 to 40 miles per hour as well. So here's our hour by hour forecast. Let's show you what's going on. This morning, lots of sunshine. Those clouds race in as we go towards 10, 11 o'clock. And here we are at noon with the leading edge of that first snow squall about to move through. Now the thing with snow squalls is they move very quickly, so they don't have a lot of time to drop a lot of snow. However, you can get a quick coating on the ground. Visibility can come down very quickly. Road conditions can deteriorate very quickly, but yes, at least they move through relatively quickly. So here we are towards 3 o'clock. Here comes that secondary squall. Notice those darker shades of blue indicating bouts of moderate to heavy snowfall. So that's why I say visibility can drop very quickly. Road conditions can drop very quickly. And as we go towards this evening, things will quiet down. We'll mainly clear skies overnight, leading to a nice bright Sunday. Tomorrow is going to turn out to be a very pleasant day, just a bit on the cold side, with highs only in the mid-30s. Today we'll be in the mid-30s, but temperatures may drop again as those snow squalls come through, so I would say mid-30s at best today, but between noon to 4 o'clock is where things could get a bit dicey. Tonight, mainly clear. We'll drop back into the teens, and then tomorrow we're looking at lots of sunshine with highs in the mid-30s. Luckily, less wind tomorrow. Monday, President's Day, a lot of people have the day off, and it looks even better as not only will we see lots of sunshine, but temperatures will be milder, topping out in the upper 40s to about 50 degrees. Now, temperatures will stay in the low 50s through Tuesday, but instead of sunshine, we are going to see rain moving in on Tuesday, and that rain will likely continue through Tuesday night. Now, Wednesday, we will be near 60 degrees, but we may watch that 60 come down a little bit late in the afternoon, colder on Thursday, and by next Friday, well, we could be looking at a pesky little system that looks to bring us a little bit of everything. We'll keep you updated at WTNH.com.